Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to automatically log into your shared drives on your NAS or any other server that's on your local area network every time you log into your computer. So every time you log into a Mac, what's going to happen is that none of your shared volumes are going to appear on the computer. That's because you need to go to the location or press go, connect to server and reconnect to the server every single time. That can be quite annoying. So what I'm going to do is show you how to automatically log into these shared drives. So the first thing is that I'm using a QNAP NAS, so we need to make sure that we have logged into our QNAP NAS before. So this one's called Snorlax and we have various shared drives here so I can make sure I'm logged in. To make this as smooth as possible, you need to have your username and password entered and saved into the keychain. And then let's say we have this folder called games and this is my games folder here. And let's say I want to make sure that this is automatically logged in every single time. So I'm gonna show you how to do that now. So basically you just go to the Apple logo here, go to system settings, and then we need to change our login items. So you need to go to the general section here, then you need to find login items. Now this is a list of all of the items that open up when you open up the computer for the first time after a restart. So this list can be quite long, but if you're just starting out, it should be empty. Now, basically, we need to add this shared folder or location onto our login items. So it's going to show you now. I'm going to press the start button here, and that's a plus icon. And then basically, you want to navigate to your shared drive. We're going to go back to our NAS, which has already been mounted. And let's select a location. So let's say the games drive here. Now, you just select this folder. You don't need to select a another file, we can select the root of the shared drive and then press open. And then what's going to happen is that that game's volume is going to be added to our open up login list. So that means that when I log in again, it's going to go ahead and open up for us directly. So anyway, that's how you make sure that your folder logs in every single time when you switch on or restart your Mac. If you want to find out how to set up a NAS in the first place, I've got plenty of videos on that. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.